Area 10, I would like you to meet my family. Carolyn and Caitlin, even though the both of you came a little late to the party, I really do love the both of you. I do enjoy all the memories we've made. Even though I'll be off to college next year, I want you both to know that you can call me anytime. Mom, thanks for always pushing me to do my best. Even though it didn't show all the time, I really do appreciate all the pushing you did. Mom, I also want to thank you for all the support you've given me and keeping me from overworking myself. Dad, whether you were, we were hunting, fishing, hiking, or camping, you always had something new to teach me. I don't know if it was just the teacher in you that had you share these things, but it made you a great dad. Dad, thanks for keeping me on track and focused. Whether it was working my animals or practicing for a contest, you always made sure I got the job done right. Linda, I know you're sad to see me go and that you love me a whole bunch. Thanks for always checking on me at the county show and the countless rides you gave me. Just knowing that I could count on you for anything really helped me out. Grandpa and Grandma, thanks for every moment we shared and memory we've made. Grandpa, I still remember that every day you would tease me by saying that I floated across the river in a basket and then Grandma getting after you for messing with me. Thanks to you, I can shrug off anything anybody says about me. Area 10, I proudly represent to you the people who've always taught me to dream big, my family. Oh, where do I begin? You have been my best friend as well as a wonderful mother. I know we may butt heads at times, but you always seem to know what is best for me. I'm going to miss you when I go off to college, but always know I will be back soon. Michael, you have only been in my life a couple years now, but we have come so close and don't know what I would do without you. Thanks for always sticking around when I was hectic. Dad, I know you don't always agree with me on things, but you're my little pusher. When things might not seem right, you always know how to make me reach my goals and stand behind me. I know you haven't had the chance to watch me grow my senior year, but I will always keep in touch through college. Mary, you're like my second mom. You have been in my life for many years now and always taught me anything is possible. Whether it was from decorating our boxes to making my scrapbook to remember my senior year, you're an amazing mom and couldn't thank you enough. Cassidy, you're growing up so fast. I wish I could be there to see you grow and mature into a beautiful young lady. Even though I might not be your favorite sister sometimes, I still love you, little squirt. Keep me updated on those wrestling matches. And Sissy, you have been through thick and thin. Even though we may fight at times, I'm so proud of how far you have gone in school and can't wait to see what being physical therapist has in store for you. You've inspired me to continue my follow my dreams and always dream big. Thank you so much for supporting me and keeping me inspired all these years. Area 10, I would like to introduce to you the most important people in my life, my family. Mr. and Mrs. Hadamio, my adopted parents, thank you for everything that you have done for me and my family. My sisters, Hannah, Rebecca, and Sarah, you guys are the best. I can always count on y'all for being there to make me smile and laugh, especially when I get in a rut. Y'all are my best friends. Benjamin, my brother, you have no idea how much I look up to you. You have been my inspiration, and I want to thank you for getting me involved in the FFA. Mommy and Poppy, I can't thank y'all enough for everything for picking me up when I'm down, for standing behind me 100% of the time, for supporting me. Grandfather, you are my greatest inspiration. Even though you're not with us anymore, the words you left behind burn in my heart. Thank you for showing me that quitters never win and winners never quit. I love and appreciate you all. Thank you for making me the person I am today and thank you for believing in me. Area 10, I would like to introduce you to the most important and influential people in my life my family. Dad, when I was little, I used to think you were a superhero. Now I just realized that you were my hero. Thank you for always being there for me and believing in me no matter what. I love you and I will always be Daddy's little girl. Mom, thank you for everything you do. You have taught me that family is not just flesh and blood, but is everyone you care deeply for. Thank you for all the late night, last minute homework help, the caring for me when I was sick, and for being my soldier to cry on. I hope one day I can be at least half the mom you are. I love you. Tyler, you're my partner in crime, and I love how close we have become over this last year. I am proud of you and know you're going to be great at whatever you choose to do later on in life. I love you, little brother. Grandma and Papa, thank you for all your love and support and everything I do. I love you both and look up to you so much. I wouldn't be the person I am today without you. Mallory, even though we weren't born with the same parents, I consider you my sister. We have been BFFs since diapers, and I couldn't imagine life without you. Thanks for always being there for me. I love you. They say you can't choose who your family is, but Area 10, if I had to choose, I would pick the individuals I'm about to present to you. Steve, 
You haven't been around for long, but I'm really appreciative of you being there for mom to support her through all of her new challenges and career pursuits. She's my best friend, and I'm glad someone will be there to take care of her next year when I'm gone. Thank you in advance for doing just that. Mom, if anyone wanted to see my diary, they'd have to find a way to open you up and look inside. You're my best and closest friend, and I don't know if anyone will ever quite understand our relationship. You've been my rock and many times kept me sane through everything. I'm going to miss you next year. Dad, I love our long conversations we have on the phone and the time we spend together at your house. Thank you for everything you've done to be a strong influence in my life. I look up to you so much and brag about you more than you know. I can only hope that one day I can be as lucky as Michelle and marry a guy like you. Michelle, I'm glad the fits that I threw when you and dad were dating never made you run the other direction because I couldn't ask for a better person for my dad or for our family. You have treated Freeman and I just the same as your own biological children, and I'm grateful for the relationship we've created. You are an amazing woman. Freeman, since you're here, I want you to know I'm very proud of you, and I'm glad you moved down here and I've gotten to spend a little time with you before I go to college. Please do not ever forget that I love you so much. No matter how tall you get, you will always be my little brother. Area 10, I would like to introduce you to the people who each sculpted me in their own way. My family. Big Sean and Gigi, though each of y'all are far away in different ways, I carry both of you in my heart every day. Y'all taught me how to live up to my word. I love both of you very much. Mom, though things may have been rough at times, we always got through them no matter how bad it looked. You taught me to always be myself and you showed me how to never give up. I love you so much. Dad, you just don't understand how much you mean to me. You taught me the value of an honest day's work and how to be a humble man. You showed me how to enjoy simple things in life and told me that true happiness can only come from within. You are a great man and I hope to be half of what you are one day. I love you so much. Brooke and Holden, y'all are my guiding light. I carry your love and memory in my heart every day. Though our time may have been short, I know one day we will be together again. I love you both. Thank you for your time. If I hold on